Oh, they're just having a little dance. Oh, yeah. Just loving life. <laughs> it would be so cool if there was that, like, uh, what did I call it? The didgeridoo type of thing with the bass? Just in the background over here. Or if we could play it for them. It'd be so good. But welcome back to Far Cry Primal, guys. So, this one could potentially be the last episode. I don't entirely know if that is going to be the case. Something tells me it's not going to because of the areas that we haven't discovered yet. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about in a second. But if you look at the camp, there's only two characters that we have. There's Da and there's Tensai. So, something tells me it could be. It's kind of like 50-50 right now. And if that is the case where this is the last episode, I just want to go ahead and say thank you so much for rocking with me this long. I really didn't expect you guys to enjoy this as much as you have. I just thought if we could get a couple of episodes out of it where I wanted to be selfish a little bit, where I could see what's going on and maybe show cool like parts of the game or something, then maybe you guys might like it enough for, you know, a couple of episodes. But you've really, really enjoyed this. And it's like, it's blown me away how much love you've given it. So again, thank you so much for sticking with me, guys, and making this as special as it has been. What are you doing over there? You got like your own little shop going? It's okay. I'm not going to... Whoa. Those things. Oh, they've been such a pain these last few days. You know what? Oh, I was going to leave it for him to skin. I want to know if the Wenger do that. You know, when you take an animal down, if they skin it. All right, let's switch you up. I think I'm going to switch you up for... I was going to go with a bear. No, let's go with the... Let's go with the wolf. I always want to call this thing the blood-stained wolf, not the snow blood one. I don't know why, but I trip over those words all the time. It should... It definitely should be called the blood-stained wolf. Look at that. Such a cooler name to have as well. Let's pet you. But yeah, like I was saying, guys, thank you so much for all the love. And again, if this is the last episode, then this has been a special one. And, uh, and thank you just for being here. I don't think I say that enough, but I genuinely do mean that. Anybody that just watches my videos, just hangs out, gives me any time out of your day to just come and kick it and watch me be silly playing this type of stuff while creating memories, thank you. Just thank you for being here. All right. With that being said, <laughs> let's continue the mayhem. Don't you do it. Let's continue the mayhem. And I think we're going to go with Tensai first. Yeah, let's go with Tensai. So it's been a minute since we've spoken to him. So let's see what he has. And we'll take it from there. Oh, man. What in the hell? Oh, my. He's all burnt up. Oh. Zila. Winja one tarwai cars. Hi. Hi, drum. Say Alia. Inacha. Sushil hai winja twice. Car we want bow. Marty Bishwa. Yep. Okay, rescue mission. Man, I can't get over that. That pain must be unbearable like uh, if anybody's ever had any kind of sunburn you know that what that pain's like it's, it's a pain that you just can't shake you've just got to wait like maybe you want to throw some aloe vera on that i don't think it's going to do it for that though but what time sunburn like a million or something oh it's got to be one of the most intense pains ever if i remember right i think you said it was the sunwalkers they've been a huge pain in my ass these last couple of episodes like i don't know if i've showed a lot of them but they've been patrolling closer to our village and when they come to these areas or at least if they're remotely close what they tend to do is they have like one or two scouts ahead and then from the back of those scouts 
they'll just have like a group of them launching these fire bombs and <laughs> it's just a world of pain so i imagine this is gonna go south pretty quick if especially we gotta rescue people all right let's grab some of this slate something tells me i'm gonna need a lot of supplies to do this oh that reminds me as well i wanted to have a look at the uh, the upgrades right let's do that now before we head over there so what have we got okay we got 18 so we can pump quite a few What's this? Find rare plants. Improved chance of fire. I don't really think I've used this or needed to use it. What's that one? Oh, the quiet sprint. Yeah, let's get that. That could be useful. Skinning. Skinning two. Beast reviving. What's this stuff? Oh, the owl drops. Yeah, we wanted that one. Owl tagging. Not interested in that. The attack. And what else was there? Oh, yeah, the chain takedown. I love those things. So we got that max now. Extra health. Okay, we'll upgrade this one just to give us the health. That's going to help, especially we're going into a camp. Reduce fall damage. Oh, <laughs> you guys already know. I absolutely have to get that. So what did we miss out on there? Bow sprint reload and bow handling. Melee resistance. I didn't even see this. Oh, wait, it's because it was Dar, right? Oh, we got another one. So melee resistance also reduces the chance of being knocked down by enemies. That could be real nice. Okay, so crafting, what does that leave us? We have the quiver that we can upgrade, the guts bag, and what is that? Berserk bomb. Throw berserk bombs at human enemies to drive them berserk. Oh, okay, so it's like the berserk shards. Which, to be totally honest with you guys, I haven't really seen a massive effect from them, but I will use them. Or will it be? It'll be this one, right? There they are. The Taken Wenger. Track the Wenger who were captured by the Azila tribe. Reward 1,000 XP. Oh, it's not a grave. It looked like a grave at first. Oh, it's just scorched earth. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's badass. I love that, that kind of thing they've gone for there where it just looks like there's either been a fight or something. Oh, that's... Oh, look at that. Oh, no, no, no. Leave it alone. Let it have its meal. You don't have to run away. It's okay. Oh, you're going to come in and try and attack my face. I love that, though, how we've got, like, little... Oh, okay, this is bad. We're going to have to use this, right? Yep. Okay. Do we have to investigate these areas? Oh, Oh, again, I just... I couldn't even imagine. That pain must be... Ugh. But since I did in the tent... It's exactly what you'd want. You just you just don't want to go through that. Got another one over there too. Can we investigate what happened there? It's not good. Yeah, it went down this way. Look, it's all down that side too. Oh yeah, there's more. These poor guys. Are they all Wenger too? Wenger slagars, uswa dramas. So they fought back, but it wasn't enough. Let's continue on then, right? Yeah, let's just keep going this way. It's like a crack in the uh, in the mountains there. This is kind of sketch, though. Oh, these. There's been a few instances where I've come across these. Yeah, this is the right way. And I'm just paranoid that we're going to keep swimming like this, and then out of nowhere, just rising from the depths is going to be like that unmistakable silhouette of a crocodile's head. <laughs> Could you imagine? <gasps> I think my heart would stop. Broken tree. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I thought that was... I thought that was it. The mash by a rocks. I feel really claustrophobic. <laughs> oh my god. This is horrible. All right, let's just keep going. Got hand marks everywhere. Oh. Oh, that's an Udam. Oh, man. Right in the gut. Who is that? What? My stealth must be so good. 
Oh, that's a Wenger. Don't do it. Don't do it. Temple. See, show us. I show Oh, there we go. Okay, so she's the leader. That's why I've, I was going to say either that's one I've not seen before, like one of the heavy hitters, like the uh, I think they're called elites or something like that. Here we go. This way. Ah. Oh, she's a leader, and it turns out she was a leader. Nice. <laughs> I'm still holding out that there's not going to be a crocodile in here. Come on, get through. Come on. Find an entrance to the Azela camp. It's got to be it. Climb. And grapple. Okay. Considering that we're going to be entering a camp then, I think... Oh, yep, yeah, there it is. Probably a good idea to get rid of the saber tooth, but to be totally honest... The stealth hasn't ever really worked with me so far. We're probably going to cause all hell now, but... So what does that mean? So we've put two in it now. You know, I'm just going to take his head off. I want to see what they do. Like, I probably should get, like, a patrol or something. Oh, is he down there? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, the saber tooth is <laughs> causing mayhem. It was saying that we uh, we had to save the Wenger from the cages, but maybe it does mean down there. Okay, so you've taken out my saber tooth. Now you get to deal with that. Burn that too. Oh, there we go. Okay, I was just about to say, like, I've not had any trouble from these guys yet, but I may have spoke too soon. Oh, I tried to get him on the way down. Don't you do it. And is that going to do it? Is it this? Oh, it's this, isn't it? Oh, that's so annoying. <laughs> it's the actual pit thing. Yeah, it's slowly going up. All right, let's get the other side too. <laughs> I was working out what I haven't burnt yet because I think everything has crumpled down. I think this might be it. Let's get this side as well while we're here. Leave the camp. I didn't find any Wenger, but let's continue on. Night has fallen now, so at least we get to see a little bit more from these Sunwalkers. I think this is the way she went, right? This is going to be bad. Oh, don't do it. She actually threw us in. Oh, get up. Get up yet. Yeah. Stay near the water. <laughs> can we just stay here, please? Oh, I think we can get out that way. Let's take him down. 
Don't know if we have to worry about, like, people dropping down into this spot. I think it's just a case of getting out, right? Yeah, let's just get out. Let's go. Find. I think this might lead us round to... Oh, no, no. This isn't the same way we came in, is it? We went round the other way. One. Two. There's a few more over there. Let's get rid of you nice and quick. Don't mind telling you guys that I think it's Azila. A little bit terrifying. Like, she had that crazed look in her eye, you know? Like, she just did not care. The way that she pushed us into that pit of fire as well. You see that thing burning? In the background the entire time? Right, we just gotta leave? Okay, let's just go. I guess the same. Oh, good job. We took that reduced damage. <laughs> okay, I don't know what I'm thinking. Just dropping off a height like that. Who do I think I am? <laughs> Where's my beast? He's up there. Let's go the same way. I got a feeling though that we're gonna run into Azela again. Warpati, Sushelhain be winds a salwaita, mas brastari, shayu guarsta. Shajan. Sushalhain <laughs> Poor Bijanha! Poor Tanji! Sasam! Snardagwa! She screams flame, burns men to ash. Upaila Buha Guarbati. Machi Battery. Madita. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, we're not. <laughs> it doesn't look like we're ending anytime soon. Erky the Thinker? Oh, wait, no way. I think I know who this is. Wait, wait, what's he just done? Winja. Is he launching a bird at the wall? Erky ye swat a quatty patashta. <laughs> Fly like birds. All right. <laughs> what are we going to do? You, I hope you guys recognize that character. Oh, that chain takedown. It's so nice to have that. All right, so hunt and skin animals for Erky. So we need snowbird, a tortoise, a raven, and a bite fish. Okay. All in this area too? So I guess we got to use the, uh, the hunter vision to help us. That looks like a bite fish. I've done this before where I've gone after these bite fish, and they just... They just get away. I think I might have this one, though. That's not a bite fish, though. Oh, wait, it is. Yeah, nice. We got one. So that should be the first one done. Snowbird. Is that the the weird looking <laughs> pigeon ones? I'm pretty sure it is. 
can easily see a lot of the... Oh, you can easily see a lot of the wildlife, right? Let me see if I can take you out this guy. Oh, I can't use my bow while I'm in the water like this. No! We saw one. Get out of here, Sunwalker. Yeah, I guess we just got to keep going around this area then. I, could we watch that to see if it lands? That's got to be one of them, right? There we go. We got one. And we only need one of them too, so... We should have this. Oh, that was a raven. Okay. Is that one? Is that the one we need? Nice. So we got the snowbird. <laughs> Where do you find the tortoise? Oh, there they are. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> do not be diving in water that shallow. Wait. Is that... Is it already dead? No. Now it's dead. Okay. Oh, I feel awful. I gotta get it. Nice. Bring the ingredients to Erky. Okay. That was actually really cool. It's actually blown me away that there's not been more of that. Like, they find ingredients for the animals or get the hide and stuff like that. I suppose it would have been really easy for them to do, but that was like one of maybe two or three missions in the entirety of this where we've actually hunted something. So it's nice. And I'm not crazy, right? When, <laughs> when we went into Erky's, like, shelter back there, he was legitimately spear throwing <laughs> a bird at the wall because it <laughs> you wanted to learn the secrets of how to fly like you all saw that oh no oh no Orky. When he does that thing with his arms, that <laughs> kills me every time. The accent as well, it's so good. Wait, what are you do? Oh, no way. No way. Oh, yes, I'm here for this. Wait, what are we going to do? Go <laughs> Turkey Joe. <laughs> like a saber tooth with feathers. Oh, no, this is going to be the end of him. Yep. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait. Just waiting to see. He's down there, right? He's in pain. I think that might be an Assassin's Creed Easter egg. Is he all broken? <laughs> Is he upset because he can't fly? Erky, you okay? <laughs> he's, he's underneath that. Erky, <laughs> Oh, more of this stuff. another dream state the last one that we did was the ice one so is this gonna be the flip Ooh. find their greatest fear oh not touch crappy what's this mess with my eyes a little bit. Oh, look at this! They fear Kratty. I wear Kratty. What is going on? 
The fire of Krati is feared by Azila. Hold right click and press left to fire a meteor arrow and unleash the fury of the sun. Okay, so we kill five of them and then, oh, what is going on? This is so cool. Like these dream sequences have been amazing. Can I just take everything out? Yeah, let's just take it all down. Burn everything. Give them a little bit of their own treatment. And there's the three. Oh, look at... Oh! That's so badass. It's a little bit weird, though. I feel... I can't explain it. It's like... I'm, my head's sinking down into my shoulders a little bit because of this thing that's, like, round the camera. It's tripping me out. Where am I supposed to be looking? Is it up there? Oh, yeah. Just let them have it. Look at this. Oh, look. Oh, this is so cool. Just complete chaos, destruction, and fun. So, I gotta be honest. <laughs> I've just been here for the last 10 minutes, enjoying myself way too much. So, what I've got to do is just take out as many of these until I get the, uh, the triple shot. And then I've got to shoot it at the moon. And I think that's going to crack it. And if you haven't seen it yet, look at that. Oh. I think we should be getting the triple shot pretty soon. It's just so much fun. Okay, right. Let's go ahead and do that then. Here it is. Oh. So it looks like we can do something else for Sailor. But I've not seen Dar in a minute, so let's go and see what's going on with Dar. Because it looks like you can upgrade this, but I think we may have to speak to him first. We're going to give him a home. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you had to do that first. So, Udam skills, 1500 XP. We've got everything right. Yeah, we've got more than enough. What was he talking about then? He was talking about skull fires? Is he just, has he got like a head pain or something? He's a very cool character as well, considering he is Udam. Dar's hut. Okay, nice. So, yeah, we can go and see him inside. Let's go do that. Oh, my. Charge 
tam han yaki kadav. Udam chartasu majish yaka. Shas kan he. Tuta shas kani wajdam. Okay. <laughs> you guys probably just noticed there was like a little cut in that. <laughs> Let me tell you all. It is exactly what you think happened. And Da is terrifying. So he's talking about skull fires, some kind of fever in his brain. Like maybe some brain swelling or something. And he gave us the knife and see that like little pimple thing that was on his head? Yeah, that was the result of it. So he said something about going to an Udam camp to go and get bone dust. Don't exactly know what he means by that. Let's see. Yeah, we've got a mission for Sailor there, too. Where is that? Oh, it's back up there again. Find bone dust to help treat Dar's skull fire fevers. Okay, so we can help Dar out with that. Let's see what Sailor wants, too. I'm interested. She was pretty mad at us last time, too, right? さ、うだん。パルフウィンジャフゴナ。チャ。チャウス。タンヒトシダハ。アキスタ。タンヒナクワイダシャンチルシ。アイシ。タンヒトシ。シャンチタ。Aish-ul-gwanda. <laughs> Laiwabi U Udam Dijamsu U Ti Shausi Shwada Nasam. Okay, so I think Sailor has forgiven us. I did get a bit mixed up with the characters too. I thought Mug was the name of that big character that came in down here with the rest of the Udam. That turns out, I think. That character's called Ul, or Ul. I think I might be saying that wrong. Mog was the one that was with Karush, right? That <laughs> Karush just went berserk with. So that makes more sense. So what exactly is Sailor asking us to do? She wants to find the rare north yellow leaf in Udam territory. Requires warmer clothes. Okay, because we went ahead and got all of that, this should be pretty straightforward stuff. And then, oh, Erky's back. No, 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 I have to, I have to. You guys already know. Strong like rock. Help Erky to protect himself from the Udam. <laughs> okay, here we go. Erky. Ash, Erky, Udam, Pash. Erky, Udam, Mamasha. Udam, Erky, Karsa. Oh, long time. Long time. Rock skin. <laughs> we gotta find rocks. <laughs> we gotta find rocks to make Erky rock skin. What? Find special Erky rocks. Okay, right. 
Where would they be, though? Like, there? Is that one of them? That's it? Yep, that's it. Okay, there's one. I'm sure there's a way you can throw rocks. There you go. Okay, that's how you do it. Okay, I wanted to try that. I'm not too worried about it. <laughs> nice. Okay, we spin this. That's not really doing anything to your skull, though, is it? Yeah, okay. Let's just get back a little bit. Throw one up there, too. Give you a hard time. Okay, so we've got two more of those rocks to find. Oh, we got more coming in? This is like all it's been for the last couple of minutes. Just sending in my Jaguar to, to take care of him. Oh, i got to put the fire out. There was a reason why I had hold of him, and I'll show you what that is <laughs> in just a second. We're burning up. Right, let's pick you up again. I was just looking around the area for more of those rocks, and I noticed this. Look at him. Right, what happens if I do that? See, now, the other wildlife, they would chow down on that. Oh, no. Oh, actually, no, I kind of want to see it. What happens if I... Oh, he's not interested. He's right there for you, though. Like, going a little bit more. Look, he's got, he's got one eye on me instead. Can I not... Like, pick you up again. Let me pick you up. Oh, that's a little bit too close. And... Really? But I bet if I take one step in there... You're going to take my head off. This. This is exactly what I was talking about before. That would be one of my worst nightmares, especially when we're in that, like, claustrophobic spot before. Just seeing this, like, come up from the depths. I know what you're thinking, by the way. It's going to attack me the minute I make one more movement. I kind of want it to happen. Oh, it's not going to, though. I really am the Beastmaster. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> Let's take care of it. It's so cool to actually see these in the game as well. I really wasn't sure whether or not they'd be in this. I'm glad that they are, though. Give me that skin. Oh, there we go. Okay, there's a second one. And... I'm not... Oh, wait. One's over there. Is it inside? No, it's behind that pot. Break that and take you. Nice. Gotta take the rocks back to him. Yeah, there wasn't really much happening here. I just kept getting waves and waves of those sunwalkers coming in. And it can be a little bit repetitive, so <laughs> if you see me just go from one thing to another, that's probably why. All right, Erky, here's your rocks. Oh, <laughs> God, what is he wearing? No. Oh, I gotta say it. That's something my friends would do. And you know exactly who I'm talking about. I don't have to name them. This is the type of stuff they would do. <laughs> They're making rock skin. Oh, I've gotta do it. I'm so sorry, Erky. This is the way you go out. Oh, my... No! No way has Erky just gone out like that. No! Oh my god. <laughs> no! Oh wait! He's not dead! Oh he's in a lot of pain, but he's not dead. <laughs> he's just screaming. Oh, I'm gonna leave him. 
<laughs> I'm going to leave him before he remembers what happens. Okay, so we're in the area that Dar wanted us to come to to find the bone dust. Okay, so it says tag the Udam healer who makes bone dust that Dar needs. Okay, so we're absolutely going into a camp. Oh, there's that drum sound again. Oh, it's a pretty big camp too. What's that? Grappling spot? Stone mother camp. Right, let me just get rid of you for a second because you're probably going to be a headache from being spotted. So I've got to tag the healer. Oh, hello. As soon as you take down. Nice, grab the body, grab the body. Oh, no, did it fall? No, we're okay. Got one over there. What's that sound? Is that these guys? Tail the Udam healer to find the bone dust. Okay, so it doesn't want me to fight them. Well, we've been spotted now. No going back. Let's just try and spread a few of these out. Oh, they've got that rot bane. Gonna keep making a few more of those while I can. Okay, bone dust. Nice. Okay. Escape the Udam camp. Oh. Do you know what? Before we go, it's been a minute since I've played around with ease. And as much as this might be my death. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, that's not my saber tooth. Is that theirs? Oh my. No, 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 no. That is theirs. Right, let's call mine back in. Mine must have died. Didn't even realize. I've just been taking them out and searching for that bone dust. But I was going to say that I want to use these. Because it's been <laughs> a minute since I've been able to just throw bones at heads. All right, there we go. We can see where Sailor wants us to get to. And I believe we got to pick the, uh, the yellow flowers. Which we said early on looked like they might have quite an... Oh. Into Udam land. What's going on there? Do I just send my saber tooth in to get that? It's not going to take long. Yep. So what's next? They've got to run off. There's no way there's a, a wolf pack that's going to come in while I've got this guy with me. Collect the rare north yellow leaf. A sailor. Okay, so we just got to find it in this area then. It was a trap. Scary Udam. Udam kapar pura swarga. Udam chamari. Aish chapul udami pan. Malchasar grawas udam balda. Wait, is he got a polar bear on his back? I've not even seen one of those yet. <laughs> oh, wait, we're actually stuck in the cage. The Udam have taken your gear. No! Wait, we 
Can't make anything either. Oh, God. Wait, do we still have... Okay, we can throw rocks. Escape the prison cell. Gotta find our way out. Something tells me this isn't gonna be as straightforward as I think it is either, right? Oh, we got a grappling hook, though. Nice, that's gonna be useful. So we can... One of those. It's gonna get another swing. You guys know my track record with this type of stuff. There we go. So we're out, but just want to make sure <laughs> before I tango with that thing. What is this? Is that actually decorated or is that something that's been stood on that? It's a really cool cave though. Is this where they uh, they live then? Okay, so they're over there. Stay nice and low. Look at that. And I never really thought of that either. I wonder if the Udam actually do eat the Wenja. Let's take him out. Get our stuff back. Try and get out of this place. This nightmare. Cold can kill. We need to keep warm. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, we're nowhere near where I think we are. Do I have to stay out of the, uh, the wind? Stay near the fire for a second. And then just keep going. Go, go, go. Oh, that's so weird. Get blinded by the blizzard. Go, 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 go. Search the caves to find an exit. That we can do. Let's get rid of you. Just gonna try and get rid of him as quick as we can. Is that all of them? No. One of them saw me this way. We're okay, though. It's a little bit chaotic, but we're alright. Okay, we got one of those big guys. I want to see what this does to you. Okay, so it, it's like for a split second, and then they've got that effect over their head. So what does that do? Does he, like, hit the other Udam that are close by? Just gonna try and pump him full of arrows with the uh, bees. Okay, nice. May as well search him up while I can get some arrows back and stuff. This is a really cool area, though. I kind of don't want to rush through it. I wanna, I wanna see how the Udama live in, like. You know, just their little tells, like the Wenja have back at our village. We've got these like little things where you can see the camps, the campfires, people playing music. These guys seem much more brutal. Look at that. Is that just... Okay, they're the ones I took out. So they've got wolves there. It's definitely human bone. We've got mammoths. What's this stuff? I've not... I have no idea. I see these everywhere. Maybe it's something that I've not unlocked yet, but... What did you have? Wait, what are we skinning? Oh, I thought for a second there, I thought we were skinning the Udam. I'm a little bit turned around too. Did we come in that way? Yeah, I think we did. So we got that way and this way. Let's try this one first. Back out into the cold. Oh. Nope, you didn't see anything. Something's going on over there, too. Looks like someone's having a fight. Maybe the Udam just kind of passing time. There's two more down. I'm gonna try and sneak up on that one up there, too. Get that high ground. It's a little bit unnerving, like, being in the area where they live. Nice. That's one of the heavies as well. Kind of want to watch what they're doing. This has got to be how they pass the time, right? The training. This is why you don't want to mess with the Udam. Whoop, whoop. We're okay. We're okay. Plenty of that. Yeah, have one of those. Oh, crap. <laughs> 
That'll do it. Kill the cave guardian. There we go, we got him. I'm just trying to take everything out. Why not? Oh yeah, there's a few of them here. They threw that poison stuff. Let's try and get rid of that heavy as well. Take down. Nice. I want to try and get rid of those heavies as quickly as possible. They're just, they're such a pain. And you get a couple of them as well. Don't do it. Don't do it. That's a heavy, isn't it? Start throwing these at you. See if that's enough to <laughs> keep you away. How many would it take to actually take one of these things down? Okay, a fair few. <laughs> I think I already hit you with some bees, so you should be kind of squishy right now. I don't know what you're thinking. Back up. Back up. I will go through this entire cave throwing things at everyone if I have to. <laughs> it's so much fun doing that. <laughs> what they got going on down here? I don't actually know what that cave guardian was. Let's have a look at how different they looked. Unless it was just the, like a, a boss of this area or somebody in charge of the Udam. Didn't quite see. Right, I'm going to test this Berserk bomb again. Are they going to fight each other now? Oh, they do! Okay. So that was my first suspicion, but... I didn't quite see it because of the close proximity that we were fighting at before. Whoever wins gets to fight me. It's going to be him, isn't it? Yep, there he is. And go to sleep. That's cool, though. Okay, can we make any more of those? Nice. Where's this going to take us? Oh, this is going to feel horrible. Right, let me just climb up a little bit more. Oh my god, are they shooting at me while I'm doing this? Let's get over this side. Alright, taking care of those two. Alright, looks like we could be getting out soon. I don't want to go that way. That's full of that, like, poison stuff. Yeah, let's keep going then. Why the nata udam guanna? Uparash. So, Sailor has basically just given us the recipe to make an antidote for that. I think it is Rotbane. That poisonous green stuff, especially when we're near the Udam. It seems to have it everywhere. And we now have access to this. Udam Homeland. Entrance of the Udam Homeland, ruled by Ul. And that looks like it's going to open up what might be the final area. And the only thing... Oh, we've got more Erky to go to. Oh, we're absolutely doing that. The only other spot is this one, Izila. So I think what we're going to do then is this seems like it's not going to be the last episode, which kind of makes me happy because we got more to experience together. But we have to do this before we end, so let's make our way over there. Long top! Long top! Oh, no horse! Woo! Woo! Horse Urgy! Whack horse! Whack what the Henry? Whack what the Henry? <gasps> Horse Urki fat ass cash yard. Wait, wait. Did you hear that? Urki now a fat Now a fat ass. Now a fat ass. Now a fat ass. Now a fat ass. fat ass. fat ass. Horse for Sakabara Budiqua. Sakabara Budiqua. Woo! Quice Harsbara. Trash. Tawada. Tawada. Trash. 
Why did he just scream trash at me before, <laughs> before I left his place? All I could hear then was he kept saying fat ass and then there was like cash or something like that. He just kept repeating it over and over again. Now we've got to get Erky a new stink. <laughs> God, this is the best mission that we've done so far. Get stink ingredients for Erky. Okay, I don't, I can't imagine what this will be unless it's rot bane or something from. Ooh, ooh, okay. I can't do it. Oh, oh my fucking god, that scared me so bad. <gasps> Oh my god, my poor heart. That scared me so bad. <gasps> I was just reading that wall because there was a cave painting there. For some reason, I couldn't read it, and I don't know why. You can see it on the minimap in blue. <laughs> Turn to the left, and there was a damn saber tooth staring at me. I could ride this, by the way. In fact, no, 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 no. Stay there. Let's hop on this. Because I have got the skill. And if we're running up against bears. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get him out of the area with a mammoth. Get stink ingredients for Erky. Okay, we're in the area then. Rhino dung, honeycomb, and brown bear tamed. Wait, what? Oh, I've got to tame a brown bear. So I need rhino dung too. Are you going to be a problem? Can I not just like... Get out of here. Go. Run away. Got a couple of mammoths there too. I don't know if they're going to attack. All right, give me that. Okay, we got one of the dung. Reach in. Grab all that good stuff. And there's another. How many we gotta get? Five. Four. And... Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, there's number five. So that one's done. Honeycomb. Okay, one honeycomb. And there's a bear over there that I might be able to tame. In fact... Naughty. Let's get rid of you. Yeah, I still see it. Okay. I only need two more of those honeycombs. And I can get the brown bear here too. Do I have the bait? Yeah, we do. Right. Throw that there. You interested? Oh, yeah, you are. Nice. Let's tame you up. It's okay. It's okay. There we go. Nice. Right, follow me. I need you to sniff out for more of that honeycomb. Okay, there's the second one. Oh, it's up there. I did like two or three passes around this place, and I totally missed this. Right, there we go. There's the third one. So that's all of them, right? I think I can actually ride this bear, too. Wait, did that bear just go to attack mine? Take care of it. Don't let it attack you like that. Get it. Oh, I'm absolutely helping this bear if it goes down. Get it? Nice. All right, let's heal you up. Oh, there we go. I was going to say, I'm almost positive that I could ride the uh, the brown bears. I know you can't ride... Which is it? The cave bear and the great scar bear. But you can ride these guys. Which is what we just tamed. So, where we got to head to now? Back, back to Erke? Yeah, talk, talk to Erke. All right, let's... Let's head back there. New Yorkie, ha! Ha now a fat ass da ha! Woo! He said it again! Uchimena! Uchimena! Ooh, ooh, ooh! What is he doing? <gasps> no way! Oh, okay, you're right. First of all, come here, bear. Oh, this is gonna be. <laughs> this is gonna be brutal. Like, we thought the spear was bad. Alright, here we go. Yep, yep. It, <laughs> it didn't last long. Erky's new stink. <laughs> what an amazing character Erky is, though. Is he still writhing around in pain? Yeah, he is. <laughs> He's still talking to him. No! Give it up, Erk! <laughs> Shut up! No! Oh my god, I'm leaving. If I go near him, is he gonna call me piss man? Mm. It's my gun. Yeah, of course you did. You know what? I'm gonna call you Floki from now on, because that's all you remind me of, you son of a bitch. 
but I think, guys, this is where we're going to end it. Once again, like I said at the beginning, thank you so much for rocking with me this long. I'm so glad you guys are enjoying this. And as always, if you are, <laughs> drop a like below. Again, it just lets me know you are. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you all in the next one.